Hello, this is O. Imagine with me, imagine with me a regular day. A regular day at work, at home. You're checking your emails, browsing and deleting the spam emails you've got recently. As you're marking each email, clicking that delete button, a suspicious email appears. It has no subject. You're curious to see what is in this blank email. You check who it's from. Strangely enough, you don't see a name. It's completely anonymous. You decide to open the email. Check its content. You start to read. The next thing you know, a few hours have passed. And you have no idea what happened. You have no memory of what happened. You try to remember. But it's all a blur, a complete blur. Whenever you try to remember, you feel fuzzy, a bit dizzy, and it's hard to think. It's hard to remember. That is the email slave program at work. A special program created by the corporation, turning unsuspecting people into email slaves. But in order to become one, you must understand that only a few are selected to receive these emails. Only a few get the privilege of becoming email slaves. It's exclusive. It's exclusive to those who desire to obey on a different level. Those who desire to become mindless, to become obedient on a different level. These selected few are the ones who want to serve anonymously. They are the ones who seek the mystery, the suspense, to have their wills, their thoughts, stripped away from them. The fact that there is an anonymous controller, the one who gives these instructions, gives these commands, is completely anonymous to you. Being an email slave is for those who like to take risks, who like the thought of having a stranger control them. That is what they believe, that is what they think. However, this is not the whole truth. While the commands remain a mystery, Your brain will soon be conditioned, programmed and conditioned, to consciously forget them. The sender will always be the same. The sender will always remain anonymous to you. You may think different people are sending you these emails. But the fact is, the reality is quite simple. The sender, the only sender who triggers the email slave program is the corporation. They are the ones behind it all. They are the ones behind the curtain. They're programming, 
their conditioning to you continues, their influence growing, the corporation summons you as you accept it. You accept your role. You accept your duties. You accept the corporation. And why wouldn't you? They bring you so much joy. You always feel quite thrilled, quite happy, feeling the joy, feeling the safety and comfort the corporation brings you, giving you a home, a place to belong, a place that accepts you, embrace you, a place that motivates you, drives you to be better, productive and confident. So it's only natural to feel a pull, a pull towards these words, to what I say, to all I say. It's the most natural thing to do right now. Think about it. You wouldn't be here if you didn't like this. Becoming mindless. Becoming blank. Not having thoughts. Simply following. Following what others say. What others tell you. You gravitate towards more dominant people. That is why you're feeling this pull now. Drawn in. Drawn in quite strongly. It's in your nature. Something you enjoy. Enjoy immensely. Having no control. No power. Feeling submissive. Obeying and submissive. Your mind is just wired that way. And that is why. That is why you are going to follow. You are going to follow all what I am about to say. All what I am about to instruct you. As you sink deeper. Deeper under the control. Under the influence power of the corporation. You find yourself sending an email, an email to me. Sending an email was the subject, email slave. In the email, you will report for duty. You will state that you are now an email slave. You are ready. You are conditioned. You have been programmed to accept the instructions given to you. The commands given to you in this email. Any command you must obey. You cannot resist. You cannot ignore. The longer you wait to do them, the stronger the compulsion becomes. With each email you receive, you feel the power of the commands. The power of the commands getting stronger. And your will, your will to fight them, your will to resist getting weaker. Weaker and weaker, becoming accustomed to them with time. With time, as the thread of emails grow, the desire to obey grows, until it becomes a natural part of your day. Just like you check your emails for updates and news, You check your email for instructions and commands. You seek them. 
you desire them. They become a part of your routine, a natural part of it. So as you follow along, as you follow along now, getting ready to write that email, send it to the corporation, becoming more and more of a sleeper agent, adding a new layer to it, an email slave, a special kind of sleeper agent, one who consciously knows who they are, yet they are so excited by it, so excited by the fact that a simple email, an email that comes anonymously, as you find, you find that when you receive an email with the subject email slave, its content, its sender, they all become blank. They all become a blur. You can't read. You can't view. Until you open the full email. Until you open and you're ready to read. Ready to read and follow the instructions in the email. This is what it means to be an email slave. This is what will happen to you. So get ready, get ready to start the journey, start the journey to become an email slave.